civil rights book. Wait, civil rights book? Let's dive in. Dearborn is a diverse city located in Wayne County, Michigan. The city prides itself on its Arab American heritage, referenced within its cuisine, festivals, as well as community events. We plan to implement mock trial teams, not only within Fortson, but within the Dearborn Public School Districts. Now, a handoff. Thank you, Serena. For those who don't know what a mock trial is, it is a group of developing leaders adjourn in a courtroom stimulating a trial where students act as attorneys, witnesses, and jurors to argue and analyze fictional legal cases. Although Michigan carries various cultures, identities, and races, making it the highest developing diverse state in the US, many leading causes of racism, injustice, and ignorance has proven otherwise, especially at Fortson. Oh, hi Serena. Hi Rami. And now for a different perspective. Come on in. Thank you so much for having me. Of course. Introduce yourself. My name is Maryam Malikamud. I'm 15. I go to Fortson High School and uh, I live in Dearborn. So if you don't mind, we're just going to ask you a couple of questions. Our first question is, what racial injustices have you faced within Dearborn? I really think Dearborn is such like a community in a bubble that you don't really face any racial injustices, injustices, at least like me, myself, I haven't, thankfully. Um, so, Dearborn's a pretty safe city. And how about it within your school, Fortson? I think Fortson is a very diverse school, so there's not much really, I mean, a lot of people of a lot of different races are at Fortson, and I think it's pretty, pretty kind community for the most part. What are your personal experiences as a hijabi in and out of Dearborn, Michigan? I think in Dearborn, it's been, you know, pretty simple, pretty easy. Everybody understands it, everybody gets it. Nobody really says anything. I think, but going outside of Dearborn, you kind of get looks, you get stares, you get people asking you questions, people mean mugging you, people crossing the street to avoid like standing next to you or stopping outside of elevators to avoid getting into elevators with you. So, like I said, Dearborn is kind of a safe haven for like Arab Americans, especially. Hijabis. How do you combat against such issues? My mom has always told me, literally, just keep your head high and smile at them. That makes them so much more. Some people it gets them mad. Some people they think, well, maybe I was being prejudiced. But honestly, just keep a smile on your face and be polite and use a polite tone, and people tend to kind of try to reciprocate. I need that kind of mindset. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, what is what is building a team of young leaders look like to you? I think being young myself is kind of seeing people around me and in the community kind of taking a step up and really f like fighting for something that they believe in, something that, that is right and you know there's really not, like, I feel like a lot of our generation, they say it, is kind of lazy now. So to see people our age take the step up that is necessary, that's kind of what I think building a community of leaders looks like. Could you see a mock trial team being implemented at your community and school? I think a mock trial team is a very good idea to implement into Fortson and Dearborn and any school, any place, any community, because a lot of students enjoy that argumentative back and forth atmosphere and this creates a space, safe space for them to do it and it also helps kids who maybe don't know what they want to do try something out as a trial and you know see if they enjoy that and if um, you know kind of just it, gets, it presents more opportunities for students and a lot of colleges which is really important look at the, the amount of extracurriculars or things that you did and it looks good for college and it looks good just in general to be able to have that experience. Well, thank you for being here today. Thank you so much for having me. Yeah, thank you. Through mock trials, students develop public speaking, critical thinking, and teamwork skills while exploring the intricacies of the legal system. 
Leaders are born and encouraged to outreach society's standards and build a mind of their own. With this being said, the following resources are to help students that want to implement mock trials within their schools. We call for a call to action. 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 Call for action.